I'm Tom from Sea Jewel Marine. I'm here to talk to you about the solar bilge pump with time delay. Um, I developed this because uh, I have a boat on a mooring and sometimes I don't go down my boat for a week or two weeks. I come down, my dinghy is full of water. Very frustrating. If you have packages, you got to get out, get in the dinghy. You got to pump it out. Um, I leave it at a dinghy dock, so it is uh, a pain in the neck. And I wanted to come up with something that can help me when I come down. That the majority of the water is out of the dinghy, so that's why this was developed. Um, so you can see uh, some features are has a solar panel on top to keep the batteries fully charged um, it has a three quarter inch outlet on the side uh, it also has pickup holes on this side, pickup holes on this side, and pickup holes on this side so some of the items in the pump I just want to go over we have quick tabs that allow you to get into your solar pump very easily So inside, you have the first thing you have is your solar controller. Uh, this controls the output of the solar panel very accurately to charge the battery. Uh, that means that this thing can stay connected to the battery year-round and never overcharge the battery. It very accurately floats the battery, not to have any problems. So we have a battery. This is a gel cell battery. It's a 7 amp hour battery, 12 volt. A uh, very good battery. We have a bilge pump, 750 gallons per hour pump with an integral float switch. It also has a manual test button here that you can turn it on and off to test it. And a very unique feature uh, that I put into this system is a time delay. So in this plastic box, is a circuit board that um, allows the pump to keep running once the float switch tells the pump to shut off. So what happens generally, this thing sitting in the dinghy, it starts to rain, water starts to come up, the float switch turns on, it starts to drain the water out of the dinghy. Float switch shuts off and there's still quite a bit of water. What this time delay does, it allows this pump to run an extra time, I, I set it for about a minute more to really suck out most of the water in the dinghy. Now, there are electronic bilge pumps that will do that also. But the problem with the electronic bilge pumps, they're always draining the battery down because they have a circuit inside them that is on all the time. This circuit only operates when the pump runs and then it does its time delay and then it disconnects from power totally. So you never drain this battery down. Which is very helpful if this is sitting in your dinghy and you have um, extra loads on it. So during the winter you can leave this all plugged in together and never worry about it draining the battery down. So uh, the other thing is when you're done with this for the season, you don't want to store it outside. You'd prefer to have it in a garage or a basement somewhere. It could get cold as, you know, 55, 50, 40 degrees. You just don't want it to go below freezing because you don't want to damage the battery. So for, for the springtime, when you, when you bring the pump back out, put it in the sun for a week or two, let it charge up before you put it in the dinghy and you'll be ready to go for the next season. The other thing I want to point out too is all the connections here will have uh, dielectric grease or sealed connections. And one of the things is that this box has a sealed gasket around it to when you lock it down and you seal this box None of the, when the water rises, it stops about here because there's air trapped in here. So all those connections will stay dry just because, like if you take a cup 
put it under water and leave some air in it, the air will get trapped in here to leave all those electrical connections dry. So that's a little bit about this pump. Um, it's called the solar bilge pump with time delay. Uh, it's a very unique uh, idea to solve a problem of keeping water out of your dinghy.